Hey everybody, I'm back, uh, still here in Montreal, and right now I'm having supper at a, uh, a little uh, a beer and burger joint uh, right in central Montreal. Uh, it's called Addie's Bistro Bar. And uh, anyway, uh, I ordered up what looked kind of interesting to me. It's a uh, uh, Primor, um, I think it was Primor, Primor Creek um, Hops and Bolts. Uh, it's a, a subsidiary of Molson Coors. But uh, I'll show you that. So it's a Hops and Bolts, obviously an IPA. It's got a nice amber look to it. Fresh from the tap. Hop smell good and fresh. I'm gonna give that a try. Very tasty. Well, I've talked before about the fact that, you know, um, pretty much all of the micros out there, uh, you know, they create an IPA or some kind of a pop forward beer. And, uh, and there's so many of them out there. And, you know, since the basic premise of a, of a pale ale is just to throw in extra hops, um, the, uh, the question is, you know, what differentiates one from the other? What, what, what makes one good and what makes one not so great? In this particular case, you know, um, you know, it's it's quite different from the from the uh, uh, indeed let it ride uh, beer that I or IPA that I tried for you a few days ago that had uh, had hints of watermelon. This does not. You know, it's kind of got the general fruitiness that you associate with with hops. But what I like about this one, it's refreshing. I, I like that it doesn't have um, it doesn't have any of the kind of um, uh, sourness. There was the one I tried a few days ago, and it was kind of tasted kind of sour. This does not. This tastes uh, fresh and fruity. good stuff. You know, I don't know how to say cheers in French, so I think I'm going to ask somebody how how that's done. Just give me a second and I'll find out. Oh. Excuse me, miss. I, I have a quick question for you. How do you say cheers in French? <laughs> well, what do you say when you lay, raise your glass? Okay. Okay. Well, because we're we're gonna need to find out. What do you say when you raise your glass in French? In French. Oh, uh, santé. Santé. And that and what does that mean exactly? Is that greedy? Healthy. 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 Hmm? Healthy. Hell. 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 I don't know. Sorry, my English. Okay. It's like L. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thanks. Uh, Sante is how you is how you say it. So you know, I'll have to look into that and you know, report back on the uh, etymology. Sante. There you go. Okay, I'm back, and I'll tell you what I found out. What Sante means? It means help or to your help. Okay, the other thing I wanted to share with you is that I uh, ordered up a meal here, and it is poutine, and this particular one is pulled pork, and um, it's pulled pork and cheese curds, 
on top of a bed of fresh French fries. And I'll tell you what, that is a really good pairing with my nuts and bolts, I'm sorry, my hops and bolts IPA. So, santé.